What is up, guys? Welcome back to Dark Souls 1. Air is about to go down into Undead Berg, where hopefully she can find Raven. Uh, but I don't believe he's here, so... We're looking for that coral still, you know? We might just find a Capra Demon. Hopefully, the uh, the bandit dudes down here might drop some of their set... Like, some of their set pieces, because that would be actually really nice. Hello. Shortcut. Excuse me. I have no reason to actually fight you guys, but it's fine. Give me that. Nice, another cracked round shield. Do we have a better shield? What's that weight differential, I wonder? Oh, we have a hollow soldier shield or night shield. Can we, uh, we still can fast roll? Nice. We'll, we'll keep this on us. Actually, is that parry slower? I take that back. Perhaps we'll keep on this. Just for that. Ah, uh, you know what? It's the same, I think. Is, it, is that a stat? It probably is a stat. I don't know. No, no, not a clue. That's the same speed, though. Aesthetically, it doesn't look right on the build. We'll put like a parry shield on or something later on. Being that with this kind of build, I don't necessarily want to hide behind my shield, so I think it might be detrimental. But then again, so is uh, not being able to hit anything, so. That was very well executed. Thank you <laughs> for watching that happen. Should have just threw a fucking fireball at it, at them. You know what? No, I'm, I'm gonna hide behind my shield. I don't care. There. Fuck you. Somebody, anybody, help me. Unlock the door. I'm finished. How did this ever happen? I don't know what key. I don't even know who that is. I don't think that's Laurentius. Whoa. Because he's down in uh, the, the lower area before Blight Town. I think. Dark. <laughs> With a framp. One humanity just give you two humanity when you pop them. Oh, it's the mage. Okay. I don't know what key that we need for that. Yeah, he's in the barrel room. Right. That's down. That's in the lower area when we get into the sewers. My favorite place in the game. Can't you open some of the? There's a guy. Is there? Oh yeah, there is. Hey. Open that door. Is it not working this game? Oh no, oh no. Outplayed left and right. Oh my god, blood loss. <laughs> we can get back. I want them to drop their hoods, at least. Are you really going to trap me right there? That was scary. This is my first time playing Dark Souls 1 not really using my shield, and it's not working out too well. Oh, you know what we should try to find? I don't remember where it's at in Dark Souls 1 now that I'm thinking about it. We need the Chlorinthy Ring. That'll be really nice to have. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't kindle that bonfire. That's fine. No one's dropping their damn hoods either. The drop rate might suck on those. I don't even know. I've definitely gotten them on a first time running through here. But I could have just got lucky. Praise the sun. Alright, more dudes are going to kick me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello. Let's bring your dog to work day, apparently. And I'm stuck in a corner and I'm dead. Dude, look at those creep. It'd be cool if the hood actually gave you red eyes like that. If I just had my big sword or a straight sword, we'd be done. I do like this weapon though. I've never used curved swords before, like ever, in any Souls game. Until I am using them right now, I guess, in Elden Ring, but that's a whole different ball game compared to this. I don't hate it. I kind of like the move set. It's just getting used to like having no range. In comparison to using a you know one of the long swords in the game. I wanted to use my pyromancies against Capra Demon, but maybe I should just use I'll just use Pine Resin. We'll use the Pyromancies to get through this area. I should rely on them more. See, like that. God. There's fire back there. Yes, is oh damn it target shield actually maybe not damn it that is a parry shield i think yeah i'm not opposed to trying this out come on come on That's what I was trying to do right there, if you're wondering. <sighs> we go again. Disasters are going after the feet of the Grave Lord servant. Oh, someone got invaded by a Grave Lord. That's the um they probably have the uh the Grave Lord sword. I know that's like a, a big thing with um early game PvP. I'm having a really bad time bouncing off shit. Actually, that might have been worth it. Um, well, hold on. 
That's too heavy. <laughs> you know, we're gonna rock it for right now. I'm not crazy about the aesthetic, but it's fine. thing is there's two of these boys in the boss room up ahead That'll, that's gonna be enjoyable double kill drops unfortunately now there is a I remember way back in the day whenever this guy was a big stop for people which he might turn to oh oh there's the I didn't know you got the whole thief set here but I write I even had that in my notes which is funny I like that better um yeah we'll do that that's much better aesthetic in my opinion. Oh, we can actually put on the, um... Did I get the tattered cloth hood? Oh, no, that's the one we start with. Uh, I'm not a really big fan of that. We'll just take that off. All right. So you can actually lob firebombs over this wall to kill Capra Demon. I don't remember if that... I don't know if that still works or not, but it definitely worked back in the day. back to my Estus. Once you kill the doggos, Capra Demon's not a problem. It's just the doggos that fuck you up. If there was anywhere to buy like fire pine resin. Like, like, really? You bounce off of every fucking thing. Come on. Come on, look at that. Look at that. Look at that, dude. It's like everything. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Can't parry the doggos, unfortunately. I think I would get stuck here, but you know, things like this will happen. Be super dope if that dog would run out first again. He sees me. I told you he saw me. Oh, 
actually anyone dropping their stuff? No. Doggos might be kind of a pain in the ass for this air, for this fight. We could put the Ring of Favor and Protection on. I was not doing that. I was holding it for now. You know what we could do? I don't even know if the S's is the problem, though. You can, um, I could kindle this fire right here. Might as well, why not? Having upgrading our scimitar game probably wouldn't be a bad idea. We need to get the plus ten overall. So our damage is probably okay. Now we did run out of pine resin, which isn't a big deal. Um, it just I think I think we we aren't gonna one shot the doggos without it, but it's not the worst thing in the world. It's less than ideal though. I probably could run past this shit, maybe. Once I get more comfortable with this weapon, we'll probably upgrade it to the Quail Egg Sword and it won't matter. Now they're going to be nice to me. See? I became human, like, alright, we'll, we'll cut him a break. I don't think we're going to be able to cast the fireball in this room while this shit's going on. I'll try, but... Wonder. Can I get one? Oh yeah, we're good now. We can do it. He can come up here, I'm pretty sure. Fireball kill! Hell yeah, there we go. Alright, cap for demon down. That was enjoyable. <laughs> 6k souls, not bad. Alright, so I don't think... Well, now I gotta remember how to get to the depths. Because I don't remember. <laughs> 
I think it's down here somewhere. I did it. Um, let's go figure it out. It might have just been over here. I honestly don't remember where the key for the mage dude is, though. Yeah, we don't have it. We could have missed it, I guess. Is it? Is it? It's not over here, I don't think. Oh god. Chill. Chill. It's no, it's not over here. Where the hell is it at? Does anyone remember where they where the how to get to the depths? <laughs> I thought it was down here, but I uh might be wrong. You don't know, Cookie? God damn it. Unbelievable. Hmm. I don't think I walked past it. Because they give you a homeward bone. I think, which is the hint to leave this area. I remember back in the day, I used to always forget what this was. This is not the new thing for me. You're done working for the night, though. Hell yeah. Congratulations. It's already 1030. It's Sunday. Oh, you had to work on Sunday. That sucks. Is it over? Pop that. I think it's back. It might be back by the dragon. Maybe. You almost always work during your Sunday stream? Oh, I think I did know. I know that you did a lot, yeah. That way you've dealt with any emails and Monday scaries are gone. Oh, that's actually not a bad idea. I mean, and you get to listen to my beautiful voice while you do it. What more could you want, honestly? I don't think it's over there. Does that give you a chill morning? I, all right. I mean, that makes a lot of sense, actually. Back to Capra Demon. Dude, I don't know where. I, don't, I forget how to get to the depths, honestly. Alright. In lieu of wasting time. Oh god, what did I just press? Hold on. Let me just look really quick. Where are you at? Oh, I was there. Whoops. Your parents are coming, gonna come stay next weekend? Nice. You guys do anything fun, Cookie? I 
if you thought we were done fucking around down here, you were wrong. Oh, you're in your kitchen a makeover? Nice. Like, when you say a makeover, what kind of makeover? What are all you guys doing? I assume paint is part of that. Stand all the cupboards, fresh paint and everything. Nice. We redid our cupboards whenever we moved in here. And I uh, got new hardware and stuff. It's not that bad. Um, we actually... how? What are you going to use to paint your uh, cupboards? Like, what kind of paint? But like just regular paint is what I'm asking because like when we did it they, they sell this like cabinet refinishing kit at like Home Depot um, And probably at Lowe's as well And um like you like sand them down you, it comes with like I guess well, it's probably regular paint the paint part of it But it comes with like um something you use to get the old paint off the cupboards and then you scrub it down You sand it you put the new paint on and it comes like a clear coat you put over it to like finish it I don't know if it's like necessary to do that, but it is something we did that um I think helped. I think it was mostly the clear coat that made the difference. So that that so the reason I'm bringing this up is the kits are not expensive, and depending on the size of your kitchen, I think we bought one one or two kits to do it, and I think it was like a hundred bucks. Something to think about if you want to look into it. I can um I can look it up and send you a link if you want after stream. I was. Reading your messages. This is what I get. Dude, they're being aggressive too. Oh, you got a kit for the countertops? I've actually never redone. I don't, how do you, do you like redo the countertops? Like, what do you do with that? I've never dabbled. We'd like to redo our kitchen as well, but it's all like, just like how much money do we want to spend on it, you know? Oh, uh, it's like multiple layers made look like marble. That's cool. Yeah, I don't know what we're gonna do in the end because uh, we don't plan on living here like forever. So we don't want to spend like you know kitchen remodels can be fucking insane in terms of price. So I don't know what we're gonna do yet. So your plan is to gut your kitchen in, in, in like three years. Gotcha. Yeah, I don't know if we're, like being that we're not gonna stay here forever. I don't know if we're gonna like invest heavily. Like we're gonna spend money to, to redo some stuff in it. Like I know we do want new countertops, and that is fucking expensive. And like I'm not, I can do a lot of stuff. I've never, I don't know if I would trust myself to redo a kitchen. Like I can do like electrical and everything. It just like. I've never hung countertops, and if it's not right, I'll get real upset. So you're mostly going to see how you like the color scheme right now. That makes sense. No hoods, really. They really don't want to drop their set. Stop. It's right here all along. But I hope you. I hope that all goes well for you, Cookie, this weekend. I hate painting. I hate it to death. I don't know. If it, I mean, I, I'm not even sure if painters like to paint, like house painters. Ow. 
one health left. Let's see, there's something over here. There is something over there. There's the key to the depths right there. Oh, that's where the entrance to the depths is. Oh, they're going to be built a railing. Uh, where are they? Oh, wait, where, where does this go? Where are you building a railing at? Oh, hello. You want to buy some? Uh, we'll get the poison moss. Give me like four or five of those. Give me a, give me a toxin one as well. Give me a charcoal pine resin as well. There goes all of our souls. It's fine. Thanks. Oh wait a second. Can I open a door? I think that I can. Oh, your dining room area is like two steps up from your living room. So you're gonna put a railing right there. Oh, there's a wood spindle one there right now, but you don't like it. So you're gonna replace it. I got you. So right now what we're doing, we're going through each room right now and kind of updating it. Like nothing crazy, like new paint. And like I'm redoing some, redoing some electrical in each room because like, I don't know what the fuck these people used to do in these older houses, but they don't wire things right. So I'm trying to fix all of that right now as we go through each room. We've done the living room and the dining room so far. The dining room is not even done yet. It's like all repainted and stuff, but I need to, uh, I need to go back through and do, um, and we need to put, I need to put a new, um, ceiling light in and then replace two outlets. But house improvements are fun. It's so fun. They say buy. Yeah. Buying is awesome. So you got to do all the shit. Which I guess is kind of worth it. It's an investment, right? So Yeah, it is just wild to see some of the decisions people made with that kind of stuff. I guess there was no rules back then. Or maybe people just didn't follow them. So thankfully, I don't need to add any outlets, which, again, wouldn't be a big deal for the most part. It's mostly like they're just wired incorrectly like if they're like backwards it's so weird because everything will still work if it's backwards but line to neutral is, is like flipped which is not what it's supposed to be and i'm putting new out like just brand new outlets in any way just because i'm sure the ones in there are super old i don't know it's weird You put on, put in all new outlets and covers when you moved in here. It's not a bad move, honestly. Well, the thing is, when we first moved in here, we were, we were, we, we were renting and we ended up buying it after a while. So like, we never really had plans. So like, we, there were some updates done before we moved in. And like, we never like cared because like we were just renting. And then we ended, like I said, now we end up, we're lit. We bought the house. So. Um. So now we're trying to go through and actually do things quote unquote correctly because you know landlords aren't exactly known for doing things correctly all the time. Anyways, now that we're in the depths, we can find our pyromancer dude. Where's the butcher? I'm trying to remember these areas. Oh, there he is.
Any more doggo buddies? You do. Can I hit him here? No. Not sure I can parry you. Right, exactly. Yeah, it is always a good feeling when you get things are done correctly. Yeah, for sure. And like, it's like kind of a gamble. Like, you like never know how it's gonna work out. Like, you can find like the best contractor in the world, or you can get like a really not great one. <laughs> Are you a mimic? No. It's if chains forward, it's a mimic. That's what it is. Okay. All right. That'll be for Andre. Uh, I don't think I wanted to do that, but it's fine. Hi, large rat. We'll deal with you later. Or we'll deal with you now. I think I fucked up there. I don't think I want to be down here yet. Oh, well, I guess. Hi. We burn our fireballs in this guy. All right, that pain in the ass is going for now. I believe it respawns, but either way. Super chamber key. Don't know what that's for. This should be humanity. So my dad was a contractor. He's retired now. Um, so he, he helps me out with some stuff sometimes. So I know when he does stuff that it's being done correctly. But like he's old. So like it's hard to like, like he has problems too with like his back and his knees and stuff. So like he can't really do what he used to do. So like we do have to like, we'll, we'll, I try to do what I can, but like I'm not. Oh my God, that's a hole right there. I just walked over. I am not like the guy. Like I don't know how to do everything. When it comes to contracting, like like different work, to so like, it's always we will have to hire people for certain things, and it's always stressful because you never know what you're gonna get. Like ideally, you could find you know somebody who got work done and they did a good job for them, so like that's your like safety net. I fucking miss Laurentius. I forget how to get back to him. We need to go up. I know that. I don't want to go to that far. Oh, well, do I? I guess it doesn't matter. I just get through. Oh, boss babe. Okay, that's that's. Oh, we're here. Fortunately, your brother was like a mile away. I don't think every tool in a workshop and stuff. Oh, nice. That's that's very convenient. I could homeward bone out of here, but I don't want to. No humanity drops, huh? That's cool. The gaggle of rats! The Skaven are here! Again. The, the way the rats attack is so awkward. Oh, look at great axe. I'm sure, it's just nice knowing somebody that knows how to do that kind of work. We'll grab this bonfire. We're probably going to want to kindle this one, too. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not going to rest here right now. We're going to keep going. Do 
You just wrote an article about a couple who was making wait, who was making 600k and was struggling financially. How? I mean, honestly, you know what? What that's all, that that's just like whenever you go so far into debt, you cannot recover. There's a guy right there. Hello. Blob. Not death, thankfully. I know, I know people who like will go like house poor, so they'll spend like they'll buy a house outside their means, and like they can barely make their you know you can barely make your your mortgage payment then, and like that's how you go like you make a you make good money, but then like you just live outside of your means, and then you're like get screwed. Oh, hi. Oh, I think Laurentius might be through there, maybe. Ow. But yeah, they just that just means they bought like the new car, the new house. And all the nice shit, and then they couldn't afford it. Yeah, same. I do not wanna that's why like I was we ended up, you know, for our first house, we didn't buy something that you know we necessarily love, quote unquote. Like, we don't hate this house, but it's definitely not ideal. Um, because, like, financially, it's like, we, we could, we could have tried to buy something, you know, quote-unquote better. But, like, if your mortgage ends up eating you alive, like, that just causes a lot of stress. And it's just a bad situation, in my opinion. Hey, there he is. Yes, you. Please, you must help me. I would have been a supper without you. Been eaten alive. I shudder to think. Thank you. Thank you dearly. I am Laurentius. Or the Great Swamp. I will not forget my debt to you. Can we do stuff now? Oh, hello there. I'm fine, thanks to you. Um, sir. Oh, hello. I'm okay. He's gonna make me go back to Fire Link. Apparently. Which, I have no idea how to get back there. You see yourself staying where you're at for a while. The only thing that would get you to move would be if you met someone. That's fair. Yeah. It's a good reason. Can't see where I'm at. Or what's hitting me. Oh, the dude. Not a dog. Why I do that? Oh, we're back here now. Get off me. Okay, there's like no ideal way to get back to Fire Link right now. But we need to go back there to get additional pyromancies, which I want to get before I progress through this area. So I just need to figure out how to get out of it. Go up here. We can run back. Because that's Moss Lady right there. Cool. So now we should be able to get access to some new Pyromancy from Laurentius. I don't know what they are. I think he has like some of them. Well, he has fireball, obviously, but I think he has, um, oh shit, um, like combustion, maybe fire whip or flame whip, whatever it's called. We'll see. We have, uh, two attunement slots open right now, so we can put two things on. He might actually have, like, a flame, like, a cleanse ability, which would be, um, pretty nice, actually, to have for the upcoming areas. Because as we go deeper down to the depths and eventually to Blight Town, we're not going to be able to get up here very easily. Alright, now I believe he should be hanging out somewhere here. I don't know where. Oh, there he is. Hello. Well, I see you made it out. Yeah, I, I made it out safely too. I have my 
I'm an the great swarm, so I can usually manage with a bit of care. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, I can share my spells with you. I think you have a knack for it, all you need are the materials. I'll be pleased to help you. Ah, um, unless you find the magic's unsavory? Yes. Oh really? But I'm on the only wood. Oh, sorry. Oh, hello. I'm pleased. Oh, and I'll be pleased to. Yeah, one. I'm sure that you know they'll be of some use, some assistance. Wrong answer well, the first time. Right now. <laughs> That'd be hilarious if it locked me out. All right, what do we need to upgrade you? Uh, is it literally just souls? Oh. All right, we have fire orb. We can get combustion. Oh, uh, we need. We want to get fire orb as well. Um, we already have fire. Why, why can you buy? Oh, can you stack fireballs? Hold on, I think you can. Goodbye. Then. Come back. Let me see. I think if I put two fireballs on, I get more casts. Yeah. So now we have sixteen fireballs instead of eight. Then that, that attack doesn't look great, but it actually is pretty good. You won the the bike and bash? What is that? Something for Guilty Gear Eyes. So we'll get Fire Orb eventually as well, too. Uh, just not right now. Alright, I think if we go down here... The Maiden is right here, yeah. So we can reinforce our flask with a Firekeeper Soul. And like I said, if you do the Latrek quest line, it actually allows her to speak again because she dies and gets revived. And then this will take us down, if I remember correctly, the Valley of the Drakes, I think. Oh, it's a bike and mini tournament for now. At least you won. Only three people showed up. You'd be better than hell. Yeah, nice. Let's take a look down here really quick. Cause, oh, uh, that goes to um, is it Anorland? It's the other. No, it's the other place. It's, I forget what it's called now. Oh, you have a sick bike and avatar on PSN now. Hell yeah, that's cool. So was that like a Guilty Gear Strive orchestrated event, Ev? I guess New Londo, that's what it's called, not Andor Londo. Uh, we could go here right now, but I'll probably get cursed. Or wait, do you get cursed here? No, you don't get cursed. No, you do. I don't remember. Curse in this game is bad. It, it like fucks your health up and you need a purging stone to fix it or a dude who's in, who's in New Londo. I think the ghosties here can curse you. But I also think that the um, the basilisks can also curse you that are in the uh, the sewer where we're going back to next. I think this goes to Valley of the Drakes though. Oh, it was PlayStation who was responsible for the mini tournament. Cool. Yeah, so this is Valley of the Drakes right here. Okay. So this is the other entrance to Blight Town without doing the swamp or the depths. Yeah, because we have the big boys here. Got a parium. Nice. Oh, there's two every day, which is probably why all the tournaments are like half full. It's a lot. Two every day. That's so cool they're doing something with it. You gonna drop poop? Hell yeah, you are. Nice.
You have a solid gold gray axe that is nice with a critical attack for your meat. These are the armor that you use in DS1. Oh, uh, that I use? No, just on the depending on the build aesthetic. We're gonna, I have like a couple armor sets I want to get in this playthrough to make some sort of looking thing. I don't know if it's going to work yet or not. We'll see. I really hate the sewers. Almost, I, I actually hate the sewers probably more than Blight Town. So we could like just go in this way instead of going to Blight Town, or instead of going through them. What? Sure about that? That's good damage for how, how it comes out pretty quick too. I like that. Yeah, so we're on the this part of Blight Town right away. I I don't know if I've ever actually went to Blight Town this way before. You basically just completely skip the gaping dragon. To New Londo Ruins. I guess we would have needed that eventually too. I don't know if I want to go. I we we probably sh I probably should just go do the sewer instead of going any further in here. It's probably the responsible thing to do. Cause I do want to kill the bosses there anyway. I think we need 8k for uh I, I actually don't want to use fire orb right now i want to keep what we have because having 16 casts of fireball and the extra combustions are nice so i think i'll make my way back to firelink shrine and then back down into the sewers after that and then we'll start the next episode at the bonfire that we found last time in the sewers so as always i hope you're enjoying the um dark souls one pyromancer air cosplay playthrough i will see all of you in the next one peace